So you, by completing this, you will be almost completing 70 to 80 percentage of the entire course platform. So you can easily skip this. They are just talking the basic uh, structure of how API Postman is built around. Click on the next button as well. So all you need to do is like understanding the task. Now you will be playing with the script. So you can, you know, there is like an add a book request which you have created over here. So you go over there uh, and you can click on the script and you can click on the uh, thing this one JSON and you click on save button and Then you can click on send button. So what happens here is like you can see in the console There is like a data has been created. So console is very useful in terms of you want to Explore how the things is working and everything now uh, that has been already done. You can see uh, the particular Postman tab um, Okay HTTP postman labs book uh, you must uh, see the recent request okay all right uh, that has been already done and uh, congratulations so uh, you have to go to the next one which is grab the new book ID so again this is very easy you just need to go over here um, then uh, go back to your console sorry go back to your console over here replace this code with this one and click on save and send button over here so this kind of gives you um what do you say uh assign into a variable now if you go uh it's like another authorization you can define using the script so when you go to the variables you can see an id has been created on this particular name awesome uh, so that's a that's the thing now click on the next button so you have almost completed now they want us to fork uh, so they want to test whether we have did everything in the right way, right? So this is Ali explaining the things over there either you can watch the video or Just understand so you have to click on this particular link <laughs> All right uh, Okay, so this is like a test your collection. So what you have to do is like you have to fork this into your repository that's the thing which you want which you have to do you can see an option called create a fork and the fork fork is been already created and make sure that you choose your workplace where the place where you have creating this which is that one then you create a fork collection so what it will do is like it will copy that collection into your repository it's basically like how the github fork forking is work so then they can verify whether we have done everything in a correct way or not. So you can see this both the collections is available right now. So they want us to go through the same thing and uh, test it. So how phase submission. Um, so this part is tricky. So make sure that you follow the uh, procedure before making the collection done. So I'll just explain in details all right so you had to create a fork you can see the collection and you can see this particular thing now you have to get the api link for your entire postman so um what you have to do is like you have to go over here uh this one and you can click on share button and you can click on via api and generate a new key this has already generated a new key now you have copied the key over here all right so that's how you generate the key now navigate to the collection test tab and variables tab and paste the link in your copy it uh, in the previous step okay so they want us to navigate to the collection tab uh, go to the variables uh, paste that value over there so go to the collection tab click on the variables uh, paste it over here uh, make sure that you paste the proper one all right click on the save button um i think we are almost there at the end of the program and things can go wrong uh, so make sure that you do it properly otherwise it's gonna be then what you need to do is like go to the test one for example um, halfway check i believe yeah uh, click on the send button now it will let you know whether you have followed all the procedure correctly or not so if you have not followed anything correctly they will let you know whether where you have messed it up so i think i messed it up in one of the path where i think i might have not saved or something so i have completed 15 out of 16 properly so i have to go back and uh, say uh, fix it 
right so that if you have already completed properly then it's really good uh, keep it up so meanwhile i'll fix this issue thank you